Here we are in Buffalo's historic waterfront. I mean, this is the whole reason that Buffalo even exists. But what is it today? It's something new. So come with me and let's check out what there is to do. More than a relic of history, Buffalo's waterfront is a hub of activities and attractions. From the Erie Canal terminus to the Naval Park, live music and friendly people. These days, there's something for everybody. The funny thing about it, you spend a little time hanging around next to the water, and pretty soon, you feel the urge to get on the water. Hey, I'm Nelson. How you doing? I'm Jason. So what's going on here? How much for a kayak uh, rental? This is Buffalo Harbor Kayak. We rent kayaks and do tours. Uh, it's $20 an hour. Sounds good. Let's do it. It's great on paper. I just hope that uh, it pans out because I'm a little bit scared. I've never kayaked before. You know, musicians don't go kayaking that much, I guess, you know. I mean, maybe some kind of musicians do, like reggae musicians or something, but, you know, kind of like modern rock, alterna rock guys, I don't know, they just don't kayak that much. Uh, as you can see, I don't wear shorts very often. So, uh, okay, all right, look at this, here we are. I'll be out in a minute and I'll give you a little lesson on the paddle. Oh my gosh. From this perspective, Buffalo's historic grain elevators take on a whole new feel. It's almost like paddling through a man-made canyon. Yeah, this is what's known as Elevator Alley. If this is Buffalo, I like it, you know? This is epic, it's very epic. Yeah, and as many times as you come down, there's always some, something else to discover. That's cool, man. Thank you. After a long paddle, it was time to relax and let the wind do the work. I hopped on the Spirit of Buffalo. Captain Rick Hillman and his family of sailors offer daily cruises out of the Central Wharf aboard this classic schooner, a throwback to the Buffalo Harbor's heyday. We have pirate adventures on Saturday mornings for the uh, for the kids, for you know, designed for ten and under. Uh, we have wine in the wind, you know, the wine tasting that uh, we're experiencing this evening, which is one of our uh, most popular events. Sure. I'm not sure why, but it's definitely true. Wine just tastes better in the wind. Mark Twain said it best: "Sail away from the safe harbor." Catch the trade winds in your sails. Explore, dream, discover, and bring plenty of wine. From your skipper, Nelson Starr, see you next time on Buffalo for Real TV.